I'm going to show you how I turn this beautiful fabric into this incredible bathing suit. Without further ado, this first thing I do is to take my fabric to the floor. I spread it out really nice and I use a bathing suit that I've had before to use as a template. I'm cutting it really big because I want it to cover all of my booty. I have a whole lot of booty, so I need a lot of fabric. So I'm giving it a lot of seam allowance. Then I take my scissors and I am cutting it out slowly and gently. Then I move over on the fabric and I use the first piece that I cut out to cut out a second duplicate piece that I'm going to use as the back. I'm taking my time as to not cut the original pattern. Now that I have my two pieces, now I'm going to cut out the top. So I'm taking my fabric and measuring it around myself. Then I'm spreading it back on the floor and I'm just going to cut a straight line down the center. I have really tiny boobs so I don't need that much fabric. So if you're following this tutorial and you have big boobs, measure to your size. Once again, I'm taking the piece that I cut out and I'm putting it around me. It fits perfectly. So I'm going to take it back to the floor and cut off the excess fabric and we have our top ready to go. Nice. Now I'm going to cut out a piece of flaps. Whenever I make my designs, I always have a lot of things in my head as to how I want it to look. Some things will work and the design will change as I make the fabric. But right here, I wanted to cut some drapings, danglings, I don't know what that is called. So I'm cutting that out and I'm cutting a strap to go around my neck. Right here you can see all the pieces. I have the strap for my neck, I have the front part of the panty, I have the back part of the bathing suit, I have my top. Now I'm putting them together put in the back part of the bathing suit and the front part of the bathing suit together and then I'm going to stitch them together and pin them I'll pin them together right here then I'm going to stitch them together I'm changing the setting on the machine now I'm putting it on the machine and I'm getting ready to stitch put in a nice stitch then I'm going to add a zigzag stitch onto that so in case the first stitch break the zigzag stitch will be there so I'm not naked in these streets <laughs> now I'm cutting off the excess thread and the excess fabric from that first stitch oh I'm chewing the hell out of that that piece of chewing gum and I'm singing and listening to my music this is my relaxation time I really love making clothes and this is so calming and relaxing to me if I'm ever stressed I just go take my clothes to my machine right here right here I'm stitching my top I'm just doing one stitch along the bottom of the fabric and that's it because it's just a fairly simple bathing suit I'm just dancing along enjoying my music I think I was listening to Alicia Keys right here now I'm cutting off the excess fabric from the seam allowance so that it fits perfectly I aim for perfection when I make my clothes because I'm a perfectionist now I'm turning the top inside out and the top is basically 90% finished it fits perfectly around my non-existent boobs um, I'm just testing it right here fits perfectly and we are ready to go okay girl get into that song okay now I'm cut now I'm stitching the piece that will go around my neck I didn't want it to have any raw edges, so I enclosed it around itself and I stitched the seam.
right here i'm showing you that i stitched the back of the bathing suit now i'm about to work on the bottom of the bathing suit i'm hemming right around the edge because i hate seeing raw edges on clothes so i always give it a nice hem stitch i'm taking my time i'm not pulling on the fabric and now i'm singing with my scissors like okay girl get into that song get get into it okay and i can't dance so whatever you see me do that's how i dance in real life i'm finishing off the stitches um ensuring that i do a nice little zigzag stitch to ensure that everything looks seamless okay now the bathing suit bottom is done and the top is done let's do a quick little fit check and putting it on as you can see there's a dangly piece but I'm going to change that later, so keep watching so you can see the final result. I'm tying that piece around the bathing suit to give it a nice little cinch. Now I'm about to put it around my neck. Now I'm putting it around my neck and it is done. Okay, you're looking good so far. I removed the cinch and this is the final product. I love it love it to date is still one of my favorite bathing suit i look good okay beautiful thank you guys for watching have a super awesome rest of your day and i will see you in my next video enjoy these pictures okay